The weather situation is pretty wild right now. Yeah, here we're looking at a category four cyclone, super cyclone, category four, heading towards Minamar. Prayers up. And as advertised, things are kind of blowing up in Texas storm wise as Saturday and Sunday we will be watching out for major floods and possible severe weather in South Texas and in my personal opinion this storm's kind of weird because I'm right here and uh I've been waiting for like two and a half hours for this storm to bring me rain and lightning but it kind of got stuck right here and it's dropping a lot of rain down through here we got some flash flood warnings oklahoma and nebraska and kansas are getting weather as well that's a pretty big flash flood warning area in my opinion how are you we got less than 40 hours left of mercury retrograde so that's good news and it's going to be a pretty big week next week in my opinion as far as the vibe shift goes on May 14th, Mercury will go direct in Taurus. May 16th, Jupiter will enter Taurus. And then on May 20th, Mars will enter Leo. And we've got about three days left of Jupiter in Aries. And as I've been saying, this is going to be a big week for war and war activities. You've got the conflict in Ukraine heating up, if that's even possible. Yes, it is as Ukraine has now fired UK provided missiles into Russia and Palestine and Israel continue to fire missiles at each other and then you've got the war in Sudan so pray for peace you know the next few days will probably be pretty wild war wise and then hopefully the vibe will shift to something way more peaceful and it is still my contention that compared to every other country on the planet, America is doing pretty well. Hanging in there. The Pakistani government has announced an indefinite mobile internet shutdown. That doesn't sound very good. And you've got talk of an economic shutdown if the United States of America defaults when it hits the debt ceiling and runs out of money. Um... Which would be crazy, technically, in my definition. America's never defaulted before. It's had some close calls, but it's never actually happened. But if it happened, it would seem pretty bad. So stay tuned. Life is almost never dull. And here's the sun. You had a 5.7 earthquake downgraded to 5.4 on the U sgs in california a and there's a bit of a earthquake swarm happening at lesson peak which is a volcano so that is very interesting in my opinion and the heat is about to hit california again and remember cooler weather leads to people being a little cooler and having a little more patience so it's going to be an interesting summer ahead of us for sure and i got a wild feeling about hurricane season you know so like i'm here in between dallas and fort worth in the middle in arlington and this storm this is four hours ago man ma'am you know and so i was like it was headed to the east and i was like kept going out on my porch my super cool porch and waiting for the rain and the lightning but like i showed you before it just somehow it just stopped which is wild and weird man i'm usually way more whimsical during these late night sessions i guess i'll blame it on mercury retrograde but like this is a very interesting situation and it is a serious situation because you've got excessive rain call this is sunday mother's day red down there and then saturday which is tomorrow you got red over here so and then a lot of weather in other states i love you other states so everybody be paying attention and take good care of your moms
Then you got a sunspot so big it's changing the way the sun vibrates or whatever. Hey, asteroid jumping funk nuggets. Barely missed us in the ninth. But man, four days old seems like yesterday's news. So what big changes occurred in your life from May 2022 till May, middle of May this month? I'm wondering. I'm wondering. Oh, hey, look, still snow on the board. This is mixed precipitation over the next 48 hours. Yeah, we were watching out for possible tornadoes and severe weather in Texas all day today. And not only in Texas, but in Iowa and Indiana. And then Monday over here for possible severe weather. Man, I plan to be more funny and hang out during this one, but it just didn't happen. I hope you forgive me. God bless everyone. Stay cool. Have a great weekend.